Happening now in Waipio, the northbound lanes of the H2 freeway near the Kauka off-ramp are closed due to a motorcycle crash. According to emergency officials, it happened around 4 this afternoon. EMS says a 50-year-old man rear-ended a truck with his motorcycle. The man was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Honolulu police say speed played a role in two separate deadly crashes overnight. The first happened in Kaneohe. Police say just before 1.30 a.m., a 29-year-old man was heading south on Kahekili Highway when he failed to turn right onto Like Like Highway and crashed into the concrete center median. Police say the man then lost control of his vehicle and crashed into the metal guardrail. He was taken to the hospital in critical condition where he later died. And just before 3 this morning, police say a motorcyclist was killed in a crash in the Kalihi area. According to HPD, a 31-year-old man was heading west on the H1 freeway when he crashed into a metal guardrail. The man was ejected from his motorcycle and landed on the roadway. He was pronounced dead at the scene. According to EMS, another motorcyclist was taken to the hospital with serious injuries. These crashes now raise the number of traffic deaths on Oahu to 18. That's compared to 16 this time just last year.